is Bob Banks, marketing manager, radio and Victrola division of RCA Victor. What you're going to hear about today is nothing short of a miracle. It's dramatically new. It's an RCA Victor exclusive, made possible only through years of research, inventions, and innovations. Living stereo, played on a record, through the all new two in one RCA Victor stereo orthophonic high fidelity Victrolas. In this speaker, you can hear the left hand section of the orchestra predominating. In this one, the right hand section predominates. And together, they give us the fullness of living stereo. Two separate and distinct soundtracks. One from one side of the orchestra for one speaker system. Another track from the other side of the orchestra for the second speaker system. Yet both are coming from one record, one groove, picked up by one stylus. Almost like playing two different tunes on the same violin at the same time. To understand how this can be done, let's first recall how regular one-track recording is accomplished. Sound waves reaching the microphone are changed into impulses of electric current. Increased in strength by the amplifier, they flow to the cutting head, moving it back and forth and cutting from side to side in the groove of the record. To play it back, we substitute a stylus for the cutting head. The tip of the stylus swerves back and forth, side to side in the groove, bending the ceramic bar to which the stylus is attached. When a ceramic bar is bent, tiny impulses of electric current are produced. These impulses of current, again strengthened by an amplifier, are carried to the speaker, where they are converted back into sound, the same sound we had at first. Now let's compare a regular record groove having only one soundtrack with the revolutionary new living stereo groove having two separate soundtracks. The soundtrack made by one section of the orchestra is on this side of the groove, while the soundtrack from the other section of the orchestra is on the other side. To play it, we use a special stereo pickup developed, designed, and most important, manufactured by the Radio and Victrola Division of RCA. In this pickup, the stylus is fastened to two ceramic bars instead of one. As the tip of the stylus moves to the right, it bends the bar on the left, producing impulses of current. As it moves to the left, it bends the bar on the right, again producing current. Now let's take another look at our living stereo record groove with its two separate soundtrack impressions, one on each side. In cross-section, it looks like this. A V-shaped groove, 45 degrees on each side. Let's put our living stereo stylus in this groove. As the record turns, the right side of the groove reproduces the sound from the left-hand section of the orchestra. The left side of the groove reproduces the sound from the right-hand section. Now, both at once, two totally different soundtracks coming from one groove, on one record, with one stylus. This is living stereo. It means that stereophonic recording has been brought down from a relatively expensive hobby into the price and convenience range of the average family, giving them the tremendous musical experience of living stereo and doing so at popular prices everyone can afford. They will come in a brilliant variety, every kind of music for every kind of taste. Along with the new records comes a complete, dramatically new line of RCA Victor 2-in-1 stereo orthophonic Victrolas, covering the entire price range. All models will play monorally as well as stereophonically. In other words, it will play any record, whether 78, 45, 
thirty three and a third sixteen and two thirds or the new living stereo records and all in thrilling new living sound in addition for those customers who have purchased or may want to purchase new orthophonic high fidelity victrolas and who may at a later date want to convert to living stereo RCA Victor will offer amplifiers stereo pickups speaker cabinets and the necessary leads to permit a simple and inexpensive conversion and now while Ferdy Grofe's brilliant and beautiful Grand Canyon Suite is being played, you are going on a ride. A ride on the diamond tip of RCA Victor's new living stereo stylus as it plunges down through a canyon of sound where music is made. Stereo. On RCA Victor's new two-in-one stereo orthophonic high-fidelity Victrolas. RCA Victor again is first. The first in the industry to announce a complete new line of two-in-one stereo orthophonic high-fidelity Victrolas. It's the most tremendous new musical experience you can have. And now it's available for everyone. RCA Victor has built a tradition of continually introducing new ideas and products to bring new thrills and pleasures to millions in home entertainment. In keeping with that tradition, RCA Victor now offers a completely new development for new listening enjoyment with tape. Watch this. How long do you think it takes the average person to take off one tape and thread in a new one? Two and two-fifth seconds? Thirty-two and one-fifth? or a minute and 10 seconds. Let's find out. Ready, set, go. Two and two-fifth seconds exactly. How did she do it? Here's how. The new RCA Victor conceived, developed, and designed tape cartridge for easy magazine loading to make playing a tape as simple as or even easier than playing a record. Convenient, practical. The first truly sensible approach to tape. But that's only part of the story. The new cartridge cuts basic tape costs to one quarter of what they used to be for the same playing time. And here's how. The old real type stereo tapes carried two soundtracks, one for each speaker system. The new cartridge tape carries not just two, but four tracks. Two in each direction for stereo, or four tracks for monaural, giving twice the playing time for the same length of tape. For monaural home recording, all four tracks can be used, giving four times the playing time, giving you more uninterrupted music than is possible from a full stack of 45 RPM records on an automatic phonograph. And there's even more. On the old type tape recorders, the slowest speed at which music could be satisfactorily recorded and played was seven and one half inches per second. But now, high fidelity music at the new low speed of only three and three quarters inches per second, made possible by the development of precision controlled RCA Victor sound heads and precision balanced motors, the product of four and one half years of research. 
and to be manufactured in RCA Victor's own Cambridge, Ohio factory. One whole hour of stereophonic music or two hours monaural in a single tape cartridge. In the past, stereophonic tapes like this one gave about 36 minutes of music and cost about as much as three LP records. But with the new tape cartridge with easy magazine loading, living stereo will be available at a cost of a little more than one LP record. Along with the new tape cartridge goes a complete line of brand new RCA Victor tape cartridge recorders and players in a complete price range to put the ultimate in high fidelity music listening and home recording pleasure within the reach of everyone. All models both play and record while all the stereo semi-automatics and fully automatic models record stereophonically as well as monorally, bringing the new thrill of living stereo to home recording. All models feature a fast forward action as well as a fast reverse for editing and selection. All models also feature an automatic shutoff that turns off the machine when the tape has finished playing. The tape is now completely rewound, ready for playing. No need for rewinding. The new tape cartridge is at all times ready for play. The new RCA Victor Deluxe models include the completely automatic features of reversing and shutting off, playing up to two hours of music at the push of one button making it unnecessary even to turn the cartridge over. Presto, tape reversed, sound head switched to the B track, all without the touch of a hand. And now some more features of the dramatically new RCA development. For easy, convenient indexing, you have first the footage counter, giving you an indication at all times of how much tape has been recorded or played. Second, two conveniently located windows to provide a further visual check on how much tape remains on each reel. Third, for easy reference, the first side of each selection is labeled A, while the second side is labeled B. Conveniently packaged in a rugged polystyrene case that keeps the tape protected against damage. A package actually containing twice as much music as is found on the conventional 7-inch pre-recorded tape reel. All in one small, neat cartridge that does not need a spare second reel for winding and rewinding. A simple brake holds the reels firmly, prevents tape unwinding and fouling in shipment or handling virtually foolproof. When the cartridge is magazine loaded in position to play, the brake is automatically released. Two easily removable screws permit the cartridge to be opened to edit or repair the tape. No need to worry about your pre-recorded music tapes being accidentally erased. It can't happen. All cartridges include a special feature that makes accidental erasure of pre-recorded tapes impossible. So simple, so convenient, so practical, so easy to use, and with all the unquestioned advantages of tape, now ready to move the tape recorder out of the closet and into the living room where it belongs, as part of the newest and most exciting home entertainment center for the entire family. One more keenly significant example of RCA's aggressive leadership, playing a vital role in developing a dramatic new product to further and advance a great new industry, the tape cartridge.